Uh, we had a patient several weeks ago who just wasn't coming in to have her, her preventative care treatments. Couldn't figure out why. She wasn't, wasn't coming in, wasn't telling us why she wasn't coming in. Well, eventually the nurse sat down and, and talked with her and found out that she had a pet that she had no one to care for if she was hospitalized. And she was afraid that if she came in and she'd have to be admitted to the hospital and stay several days, that there was no one to care for her pet. A simple solution for us to solve, we just needed to know about it. So we were able to get her connected with the local animal shelter who found someone to foster her pet for as long as they needed fostering. And she came in, she had her treatment, she went back home again and it all worked. But it's that, that level of interoperability, which we didn't really think about being interoperability years ago, but being able to have that connection to a local animal shelter, a local veterinarian, a food bank, um, someplace that, to be able to enable our patients to have the security that they're able to come and have their care.